Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be my SAS haul number two. So I did do a haul already from the first day of SAS where I went to my outlet store and I did a walkthrough. I'll link it up above so you guys can go check that out. But today is Saturday and I wanted to go and check out my outlet, but also a store that I hadn't been to before, um, which is like just down the road for me. It's a white barn and Bath and Body Works. And so I will have the walkthrough of that either up before this video or after this video, probably before. Um, but I did do like a quick haul of everything, but I kind of want to sit down and like talk to you guys about how it went. So that's what this video is. And I'll like talk through all the products that I got, but I did already do one haul. So please go watch that first if you haven't already. Um, but let's get into the haul from today. So first things first, I do have to mention this one item that I picked up for 75% off actually at a store near my work. So um, my boss, my coworker and I were going out for food and um, we just so happened to be next to a Bath and Body Works and me and my coworker, JC, she's in my vlogs, um, we had to go to the bathroom. So we went to Target and right next to Target was Bath and Body Works. And I wanted to go check out that store anyways because it's right next to my work. It's like on my way home. And they didn't have a lot of crazy good deals or anything. Um, nothing like crazy that I found, but they did have sugar cherry crisp and i had not seen it that was the first time i had seen it i actually don't think i've seen it in stores again um, but they only had it in the shower gel and so i did pick up sugar cherry crisp if you guys don't know this is from last fall i had it in the body cream that i actually used up in the springtime just a few months ago and i adored it i had it in the spray i had originally gotten it in the spray in the fall but it kind of smelled it reminded me of a scent that my grandma used to wear, but not like in a good way. It was like really powdery and I kind of can't stand powdery um, scents. So I returned that, but I did have it in the body cream and I loved it. And so I got it again in the shower gel now. Um, they are supposed to have the spray in stores, but I have heard that it's like not as strong as it was in the fall. So I don't know what that's about, but it smells amazing. So juicy. It's bright cherry delight, crumbled graham cracker and spun vanilla sugar. And I will note that the uh, manufacturing date on this one does have a one on it. So it means that they manufacture these specifically for SAS, which is like amazing because I feel like that, that means that they were listening to us. Um, they brought this back and um, what's the pumpkin one? Marshmallow pumpkin latte. They also brought back that in just the shower gel for SAS and it was manufactured this year. So I feel like they're listening to us and like hearing what we have to say. And a lot of us were like obsessed with the scent in the fall. So they brought it back for SAS. So that makes me really happy. Um, but I will say on how to read where the manufacturing date is. Um, so it is instead of this barcode with the scanner on it, it's actually up here. And I'll show you on a few different products because this one you can't, can't really see it that well since it's so dark. But here we go. Um, there it is. So it's this um, number up here. And if there's a one at the beginning of it, it means it was made in 2021. There's a zero, 2020, nine, 2019, and so on and so forth. So that's how you can tell the year that it was made. I always try to look at stuff from SAS because if it's like kind of old and it's a lotion or something, then maybe I won't want to buy it. But these are brand new, made specifically for SAS. So very happy to have this one. I'm so excited to use it in the fall. It smells so cozy like literally like cherry pie. It smells absolutely amazing. So pick this up at a totally separate store from the ones that I went to today. But I do have a little bag from the store for today. So I will pick out my stuff from here and show you guys what I got. Okay, so at all the stores, I didn't really get too much stuff, um, but combined, I did get a lot. Um, so I have the receipt in front of me and I'll just go through everything. So the first thing that I noticed was they had a 50% off section with some pocket bags and I will never say no to a 50% off pocket bag. So these were all 97 cents. I got orange sunrise, um, just literally smells like oranges. Smells really good. I feel like this is a good fruity one like that my mom and my dad also want mine. So if they want to use that, they can. Um, Honolulu sun, which is kind of just like coconutty sunscreen almost, I think to me. And then um, Waikiki Beach Coconut, another coconutty one. These are really cute. I love the packaging of these. And yeah, it's just like a coconut scent. So those are all 97 cents. I think getting hand sanitizers for 50% off is always a good deal. And then also one of the first things that I saw when I walked in the store was the 75% off table. And this was the last thing on the table. 
Tis the season and a three wick. So this was actually, let me see how much it rung up for. It was $6.12, so a $6 three wick candle. I fell in love with this um, scent in the hand soap during the winter time last year, and so I was down to get it in a three wick. Actually, do I have this in a single wick right now in my bathroom? Mm, let me go check. Hold on. Please hold. You guys. Oh my god. Okay, so can confirm. I have it in the single wick already. <laughs> it's tis the season. It's like literally just juicy red apples. I thought it smelled familiar. Okay, well I've been burning this in my bathroom um, lately. It's just like smells like apples. I don't think it's like exclusively a winter scent. Um, but this one, the scent notes are rich red apple, sweet cinnamon, and cedar wood. I feel like in the single wick it's not super cinnamony, but in this, in the three wick, it's definitely cinnamony. My mom even smelled it and she was like, wow, that smells exactly like Christmas. I was like, yep, I know. I'm gonna save this one for Christmas. So $6, you really can't pass up on that good of a deal. So I decided to get it and that's the first candle that I've gotten for the entirety of SAS. Pretty proud of that price point at $6, like that's amazing. Um, the next thing that I got was actually with all the 50% off stuff, but I knew from Instagram posts that it was gonna be 75% off. And that's um, Hip Hop Hooray Sprinkled Donut Hand Soap. I had this in like around Easter time and I loved it. And it was right next to the other one that was like the Easter one with chicks on it. I think it was like spring day or something. I didn't like the scent of that one, so I didn't get that one, but I just got one of the sprinkled donuts. It was $1.87, so can't pass up on that good of a deal. And I feel like this would even be a good one for the fall time, um, but I might just save it for next Easter anyways, since it's like, you know, Easter themed. But I, I loved this scent and I couldn't pass up on a 75% off soap so always ask your associates to um to try and price check things for you if you can i i just told her i was like kind of a, a little bit of a white lie but i was like oh i was at the outlet the other day and these were 75 percent off can you just check for me and she was like okay yeah i'll i'll go check and then she went and checked she's like you're right there 75 percent off and i was like awesome so i picked up this one um but they're always really nice and helpful sometimes you know, instead of saying like, oh, I found on Instagram that they're 75% off because they get like kind of testy about that stuff. Maybe say, you know, oh, at the other store or oh, my friend sent me a message that that was 75% off that she got. So just, you kind of have to work around that sometimes, but that's it for the 75% off. And then for 50% off the men's body care, I had been looking for a perfume for myself, but I saw this and it was like too good of a deal to pass up on. So 50% off of cologne. And this was originally $39.50. So I got it for $19.75 and it is Oasis um, for men. Oh, you can see my tripod there. There you guys are. Um, but yeah, originally $39.50, or $39.50, sorry. But I smelled it in stores, it smelled really good. You can even like smell it through the packaging. I think it smells amazing. Is it supposed to come with a lid? Because mine doesn't have a lid on it. It's a little odd, but it's very sleek. So I think it smells amazing. It kind of smells like Hollister, but this will be saved for somebody for a present probably, but I couldn't pass up on such a good, oh, no, it won't close. Such a good deal. So went ahead and picked that up, but that's everything from the first store. Now the second store, I got a little bit bigger of a bag because I got some really good stuff, I think. Okay, so the second store was actually my outlet and I had been to the outlet on Monday and they had like a whole section of $2 soaps there on Monday and they were all like winter Christmas time soaps. So I didn't really even pay attention to that table, but today they were all like beachy summery scents. So today I got a bunch of $2 hand soaps perfect for summer. So the first one is a vanilla coconut. I love this packaging on this little line here. I think this is actually gonna be a really good scent. My mom doesn't like coconut too much, but I do. So I'll probably leave it upstairs in my room. Just a really nice, like refreshing summery scent. So $2 for this one. And then we have Island Margarita in the Gentle Gel. I don't mind the Gentle Gel. Like if I can get it for cheap, then I really don't, I'm not picky about the formula. Mm, Island Margarita smells so good though. Um, and then Island Papaya, which also was $2 in the same kind of packaging. This one smells really good too. I've had this many times before. Just very fruity and fresh, so yummy. 
And then Boardwalk Vanilla Cone was actually 75% off. And we've already actually used this this year. I think we just finished one downstairs like last month. So I might wait a minute before we use this one again. But it smells amazing. It's literally just like vanilla, vanilla yumminess. So this one was $1.87 because it was 75% off. And then right next to the checkout, they had a $2 section, which um, the other day I was at that $2 section on Monday. And all they had were like Christmas wallflowers and sugared snickerdoodle car fragrance refill and i was like mm, no i'm good but today they had a new one they had a mary mimosa in the wallflower fragrance refill the notes on this are sparkling champagne red apple slices and iced sugar crystals it kind of just smelled like champagne toast to me so i think this is a really good scent for like the bathroom or maybe the kitchen um so i'm glad to have found this for two dollars and then they had some new car fragrance refills so they had sun wash citrus so i got this one for my car and this should last me for the rest of summer because i have one in right now that i just put in they last about a month for me um, and so this one I'll put in in July and then maybe by August I'll be ready for pumpkin cupcake Which is one that I already own so and then I did cave and I bought a $12 candle I had been kind of telling myself, okay, maybe only go for the 75% off But I knew that I wanted one of these two candles and that was between champagne toast and strawberry pound cake So comment down below which one you think I chose Okay, I chose Champagne Toast. <laughs> so it's in this beautiful packaging from the bake shop in um, the springtime. Cirrus is such a beautiful scent. I just realized that I got the lid that didn't have like the really cute like filigree um, pattern on it. So that's kind of sad, but it's fine. I really, I'm really not picky about the lids or anything, but Champagne Toast is such a good, good scent. Um, the notes, are they on here? Yes. Why does it say made in US? It says made in US, of US, and non-US parts. I wonder if this is from Canada. Like I wonder if this was meant to go to Canada and that's why they had to have the sticker because I've never seen that sticker on any of them and I can't get it off. Um, okay, champagne toast. Bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, and juicy tangerine. Definitely smell the tangerine in the candle. I think it smells so fruity and fresh and I just finished my single wick in this last month and I've been kind of like sad that I don't have any more. So I chose this instead of strawberry pound cake because I feel like strawberry pound cake may only last me like this summer and I may not want to use it anymore in the fall. But this one, I'll, I feel like it's like a year round scent. Whenever I'm ready for something fruity, I can use this one. So I'm very happy to have this one. Like I almost just want to light it up today, but I am burning ice blueberry biscotti right now. So we'll wait on this one for a, a little bit, but this this is the uh, the twelve dollar candle that I got. So so that's everything for the haul today. I do plan on going back a few times. I think I'll go like near the middle of the sale in like a few weeks, and then at the end of the sale, just to see if they have anything else. I'm pretty much good on soaps, on body care. Um, I'm pretty much good on car, car fragrance refills. I could get like another one more. I really want some more. Um, wallflower refills because I don't feel like paying $3.50 for them is a good deal. I feel like that's not a good deal. So if I can get them really, really cheap um, near the end of the sale, then I'll just wait and see. Um, but we have been using that using them at our house, so I want to get some for like really, really cheap. So I'm just going to wait for these um, and then I'll wait and see if any of the other candles go on sale or if I can find like little tester candles. So that's kind of like my game plan or like mini body care. That's like the only other things that I really want, but I pretty much got everything that I need. Like I needed hand soaps to get me through the summer. So very happy about that one, but that's everything for this haul for my second haul of SAS. Let me know down below something that you guys got at SAS that you're super, super excited about, that you're super excited about. But I think for me, it is Sugar Cherry Crisp because it makes me so happy that they're listening to us and bringing stuff back. Um, but also like, I love this scent. So very happy to have that. But anyways, that's everything for this video. If you enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.